Channel 92 News with Landon, Jacob, Jace, Whitney, and Emma. Good morning, Mount Vernon Junior High. I'm Elena. And I'm Luke. And it's time for your morning broadcast. But before we get to today's breaking news, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance, allegiance to the flag of the United, United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice to all. And now on to today's announcements. Girls grades 5 through 8 are invited to attend the Girls in Bloom Expo on March 15th in Evansville. If you are interested, please pick up a brochure in the main office. Student Council, there will be no officer meeting this week. The video crew will not meet this weekend. Mr. Purvis will reschedule with you at the next SC meeting on March 13th. All Language Arts academic team members continue to read the material for this week. We will meet during the Flex on Friday to discuss it. The next club day will be March 19th in the morning. And now to a Builders Club slash Student Council special announcement. Hello, I'm Joseph. And I'm Mrs. Schneider. And we're here with your Student Council update. And Builders Club. Any student on the Student Council who would like to help with after school tutoring should see Mr. Purvis. You'll meet every Monday and Wednesday from 3 to 4. You must have a strong grasp of language arts and math material. The St. Matthew's PTA is hosting a 5K family run. They need volunteers to help with this event on Saturday, April 12th from 7.30 to 10.30 a.m. And this could be for Builders Club also. Any member who would like to be on the bowling team for Big Brothers Big Sisters should see Mr. Purvis. And now for the Hearts for Humane Society drawing. We'd like to thank everyone who participated and brought in things for the Humane Society and we have our final three drawings for today. Hello, I'm Joseph. And I'm Mrs. Schneider. And we're here with your Student Council update. And Builders Club. Any student on the Student Council who would like to help with after school tutoring should see Mr. Purvis. You'll meet every Monday and Wednesday from 3 to 4. You must have a strong grasp of language arts and math material. The St. Matthew's PTA is hosting a 5K family run. They need volunteers to help with this event on Saturday, April 12th from 7.30 to 10.30 a.m. And this could be for Builders Club also. Any member who would like to be on the bowling team for Big Brothers Big Sisters should see Mr. Purvis. And now for the Hearts for Humane Society drawing. We'd like to thank everyone who participated and brought in things for the Humane Society. And we have our final three drawings for today. I'll draw one. You draw okay. one. Okay. First winner is... Emma Yarber. Emma! <laughs> okay. Uh, see? Caleb Stoltz. Hello. <laughs> one more. Do the honors? Uh, no, how about you do this one? Okay. And Brad Miller. B -b -b Brad. <laughs> and that's it for your student council update. Back, Back to, to you. Back to you. and Brad Miller need to come to the office. You won the Humane Society drawing. The Mount Vernon wrestling team traveled to Castle North last night to take on the Squires. The Squires won 46 to 29. But we did come out with some first place finishers. Nathan Lyre, Anthony Robles, Connor Sled, Alex Stewart, Luke McGinnis, Debbie Tolliver, and Seth Hargett. Congratulations. Eighth grade girls interested in trying out for the high school cheer team stopped by the main office and see Ms. Deno for a packet. Tryouts will be held the week of March 17th. In intramurals will only be held the day after school, 3 o'clock to 3.45. You'll be playing dodgeball in the auxiliary gym. The 7th and 8th grade go The 7th and 8th grade girls and boys interested in track should plan a to attend a meeting today during home base. The, scroll, the girls will meet in room 823 next to Mr. Boyer and the boys in Mr. Crandall's room at 315. For a culinary delight, fish or hot ham and cheese, baked beans, 
post-law, veggies with dip, dip, fruit, and milk. Today's happy, happy birthdays go out to no one, nobody. To this week's word of the week is preserve. To remain con persevere. Persevere. To remain constant to, to a purpose, idea, or task. In the face of obstacles or discouragement. All right. And uh, first, I wanted to mention, every now and then we hear students say things like, well, I-STEP doesn't matter, you know, it doesn't count for anything. Well, it does. It's very important. It reflects on the entire school, and we've got a good community, a great community. We've got great parents. We've got great students and an awesome staff as well. So we want to make sure that every time you come in to take a test, you put forth your very best effort. However, you don't have to stress over it. You, your teachers have done a good job preparing you. Just make sure you get good rest and you eat a decent breakfast before you come to school and make good choices at lunch if you're testing after lunch. But once we start testing, it's nothing to stress over. Just do your very best in all that you do that day. Um, so that's, it is important. It reflects on the school, like I said, but also we use that data to figure out what help you need um, to prepare uh, for the next year in that subject and to place you correctly in the right classes. So that data is very important. It, no, it doesn't come back directly to each individual student and mean that you're going to need to take, you know, summer school or do anything different. However, it does help us place you and direct our efforts in helping you. And it does reflect on our school when we get our school grade. And we want that, that reflection to be what we are, which is a great community and a great school. So I appreciate your effort, and remember, we're going to have a celebration for the students that put forth a great effort. Your teachers take note of that, and you'll get to participate in that celebration again coming up sometime after spring break or, or after the second round of the testing. Um, at this time, here's what we need. We need these students to come down to the office. Um, actually, let's, let's, we'll finish the broadcast, then I'll do this off, off the, the recorded part. Um, you can remember you control your own attitude and effort, so make You're both great, great and, and we, we are, are. MV. MV.